Hello, I'm back again, this time, hopefully, with sound. It's not the easiest thing to do to get started with uh, live live shows, but I hope this does it. I'll be checking in uh, on the sound while talking, but thanks for watching, thanks for joining, and for everyone who participated in our previous webinar about prolonging of production wealth. Oh, so, planning of production wells and exploration wells, where we looked at data and workflows. We had some experts from Shell sharing their insights. I watched it over and over again to learn, and I pick up something new every time. So if you haven't watched it yet, I suggest you do. You can find it over on YouTube. Um, and please leave some comments uh, about what you liked about that uh, webinar. Uh, we're not an industry which shares so many thoughts. We sort of keep our thoughts to ourselves. I think we can improve on sharing our thoughts with each other. If we disagree or agree, sharing is caring. That's how we move this industry forward. So again, thanks for uh, watching. Uh, today I thought I'd sum up a bit of the talk and then I will share in the end, towards the end, I'll share some uh, a new feature we have uh, on how you can easily compare your wells in planning, you know, the dashboard function which we have expanded lately, which has been on demand by users for, for a long time, so we're super happy to have it available for users today. So this is what we are talking about. This is why you are watching. This is where we want our industry to go. Today we're in the manual uh, domain with lots of documents and uh, uh, the documents are used to transfer information across decision gates uh, and into operations and also through the stages of well planning where we have the broken lineage. Because every time we write a document to make a decision, we are losing all of the other details, which are either in the heads of brilliant people or in the technical calculations, in spreadsheets, in expert applications. But we're losing a lot of data every time we are making decisions because the documents survive, but the, uh, the details don't. They, they are carried by humans. And there are so many brilliant people in our industry. So there's, there's no we always manage to drill a well and get to get to our goals, but we can definitely improve on planning better, having more details in the planning, adding more advanced technology to the operations, and that's where you need an advanced planning module. And that's what we do in ProWell Plan. Uh, we provide the workflows and the data management where you have high quality data in every design you're creating. Uh, and you have high quality offset or historical data to support your decisions. And that means you can have experts working on contributing instead of uh, or instead of uh, reviewing. You can have more people involved. Today it's very limited. You can have one or two or three experts maybe working on a well, but after that, putting more people on a well planning is it, it call, it, it's not very efficient because the manual workflow doesn't share enough information for everyone to contribute. But in the digital workflow, you share a link, you share access to your five different designs, your 10 different designs, uh, all the work you have been doing. It's easy to bring experts in to help you. It's easy for managers to get an overview and see what is going on. And all this shaves off hours and hours of work, which is typically what engineers and managers do today, all the reporting, and it frees up so much time to do more advanced things. And it also makes it easier to introduce more advanced technology because everyone can see the benefits without having to learn all the details about the new technology. And if you want automated operations, if you want robots to do high precise operations on a rig, if you want to use detailed mud, mud measuring in your decision support, you need an, a digital twin, uh, an automated system to capture all your learnings and provide them during operations when you need that. And that's what ProWell Plan is here for you. And everything is integrated with all your other expert applications. ProWell Plan is not here to be the one, like many of the big oil co big service companies want to be. We are here to integrate and work together with all other applications. That's our. That's what we make money of, our pay-per-use money. The more we connect with everybody else, the more data is flowing and the more money we're making. So we're not like most other companies in this industry trying to squeeze out the other ones. We try to get more 
data flowing because that's for the benefit of the operator and it's for the benefit of us. That's a good common KPI. And I thought I'd give you a short uh, demo of a recent feature, which we are very proud of. Uh, this is our uh, dashboard. It shows you all your designs. It shows you the number of sections, the time depth, uh, the time per well, uh, the CO2 emissions per well design, average drilling rate is uh, cost and the cost per day. And you can, and this can be customized uh, at your uh, uh, wish to the, present uh, the KPIs that you are using in your uh, well planning. So it gives you an overview of all your designs. And this is important, the shift from one design, which is typically in a, in a report, to having multiple designs. For us, when we're planning well, the goal is to have planned for all the potential outcomes of the well. Not to have the approval of one well design, that is basic, but planning for all the outcomes so that when we are, are planners, we're proud to say we have planned for all outcomes. And as long as the operations end up within the perimeter of our well designs, we say we did a good job on planning. We knew what was going to happen during this well. We knew there were many alternatives of what might happen. There are many, so many uncertainties in, in well operations, but we knew uh, how to prepare for it. We know how to plan wells. Um, and uh, you get a brief uh, snapshot here with our new uh, dashboard. You can see uh, the pressures, you can see the geology with uh, the units you want them to be in. You can see time depth, you can do well path plots, you can see the risk matrix, and you can see the overall design. And if you click on this, you will go into more detail to see, see all the details on all the operations. But another fun, fun part of this is you can see who has been working on this. Who are your colleagues who have op updated this? Who worked on the different designs? And you can easily switch between them. And you can see that uh, Katrina is the only employee I should really uh, keep. Just kidding, because I'm here too. I did some work with me, but that's not the point. But you want to connect with other people. You want to know what people are working on. That, that's typically what engineers are doing. They're sitting in Maybe there's two or five or 10 engineers working in the same room and they all wonder what the other ones are doing because communicating well is very complex. And there's so many smart features, like if you want to see all your uh, pressure data as a pressure plot instead of an equivalent mud weight, well, that's just a click away. And this can be shared with anyone. So this is built to save you time in making presentations and PowerPoints and documents. And that sounds very great. And that's what our users have, uh, have asked for. So we're very proud to have this dashboard available. And as I said, you can click into all the details to see, uh, to see, uh, see more. And, uh, um, and as I mentioned that about integrations, now behind every plot there is a high quality data set, which can be sent to anywhere in the workflow. So if you're a stakeholder, if you are uh, working, uh, as a, if you're a partner, if you're in subsurface, if you're the owner, if you're paying for this well, uh, if you're the mud expert, if you're the MPD expert, if you're a vendor who are looking for the casing setting depths, if you are, who are, who are in, you're in operations and you want to know what are the alternatives we are looking at, all these stakeholders get high quality data, beautifully uh, visualized. But also through integrations, the data can flow to your application, the, your favorite application, the one that you use to, to visualize and make decisions. And when data is flowing back and forth, everything is updated. All your applications is updated, and that saves you so much time in making reports and communicating. So that was a brief um, presentation of our newest feature. We are planning new webinars, which will be coming up soon. One on being a stakeholder of the well planning process. So being the owner, being subsurface, or being a partner, or being a vendor, or being an expert. Everyone who wants to contribute, but often find it challenging uh, to get all the information and provide as much information as you want to, because the communication is limited very frequently, often to PowerPoints and, and spreadsheets. The other one is on the data. What, what is our data? Where is our data? We've been working a lot on improving data quality, finding data, uh, and so have you. We know 
And we want, if you're the expert in data management, we would like you to join our next webinar. If you're a stakeholder of the drilling and well process, we would like you to join our next webinar. So please reach out, uh, comment below, uh, let us know, send me a LinkedIn message, send me uh, an email, just reach out. We're happy to, uh, to talk. Uh, maybe you want to uh, contribute with some new ideas. We would love to hear that. So, see you soon. Um, if you enjoyed this uh, video, please uh, like and subscribe uh, or click like uh, on LinkedIn. Write some comments about why you watched this and what you found interesting. And then we'll be back before you know it with more information. Thanks for watching.